daughters that is, is that he's working uh, good around their lives. And then he says in verse 29, for, for, for God, uh, those God that he foreknew, he also predestined to what? To be conformed to the image or the likeness of the Son. Now he didn't say the likeness of my child. He said the likeness of my Son. Again, inferring that we be sons and daughters as well. That not into just the image, uh, and we think about that. We think about the, uh, uh, you know, um, being uh, in the likeness of, not so much, he's not talking about the outside of things. He's talking about the character. He's talking about the, uh, the evidence of his son that he's talking about here, that he spoke from heaven, saying, this is my son in whom I am well pleased. Yeah. He said that when he was adopting his son. He said that uh, when during the process of, of saying, this is, this is what, uh, what I have for you to come into the likeness as sons and daughters, that he might be the firstborn among many brothers. So uh, I think about the about uh, image. I, I, I had a thoughts, a few thoughts that came to my mind. We're going to look at a few uh, uh, images here of famous people. And I just want you to tell me, just, uh, you know, we're going to go through four or five of them, and just uh, somebody just shout out who, uh, who this is. That's the first one. Eddie Murphy. <laughs> Eddie Murphy. <laughs> demonstration 
uh, to, to the kingdom of darkness that matters the most. Because it's the kingdom of darkness. Your battle is not against flesh and blood. You know, it's not about being, you know, being uh, uh, recognized so much about by your neighbors as you being uh, being a believer. I mean, that that needs to happen too. <laughs> Amen. But the passages, most of them, are emphasizing that that it is the kingdom of darkness. You know, that the, the manifold wisdom of God be seen and demonstrated to powers and principalities because they need to know that you're a believer. Yeah. They need to know that you're a son and a daughter. There needs to be those that get up in the morning and they, they were carrying this, uh, the, the aspect of sonship and, and daughters of God into, into our workplace and into, uh, uh, into the highways and the byways, compelling people to come in. That's what, the, that's what sons and daughters do. And it's the kingdom of darkness that needs to be affected and, and impacted so that, uh, that, that the uh, that spirit of, uh, of deafness that is on the uh, on an audible nerve uh, or there on the optic nerve for those that are, are blind, when you speak to that, uh, that devil, you command that thing to come up in the name of Jesus, it releases it because it knows that you're a daughter of God. It knows that you're a son of God because they have the powers of darkness. They know where the light is. They know where who is a son or a daughter and who is not. 